football is back, ladies and gentlemen. I know I've already been to another game, but tonight the Celtic fans have taken over at Ayrshire. Yes, tonight is Celtic versus Air United, and tonight Celtic are opening up the new North Stand for Air United. And well, Air United have just built a new stand. If you see my uh, Ayrshire video, um, that the uh, you can get in because they're all they're doing is construction. That's what it is for tonight. Celtic fans will be opening up the new North Stand. And yes, I actually got, I never actually said this in the uh, Celtic Lost County video, I got to stay in here because we've just parked at a place called Air Racecourse. But I actually got a free Celtic scarf from a Celtic fan when I was at Celtic Park in January or something. And what it says on it, it says, let me show you for a wee sec, 1916. If any, and that badge, can any Celtic fans tell me what that means? Because I genuinely have no clue. But we're only a wee five minute walk from the stadium and already so many Celtic fans are already here. I think everyone's buzzed in this town tonight. Well, can we see Celtic for another win? And let me tell you another fun fact. Ayrshire's manager right now, um, his name's Scott Brown. Um, he's actually an ex-Celtic legend. I actually met him at the school of Right, he's called right there United in Cape Park. So yeah, it was really good meeting him. But can Celtic fans beat him again in week United? Let's find out. Tonight, I thought I went in across the road here. Tonight was a wee bit boring, and I just didn't want to sit in the air United and for all these reasons. Celtic tonight are bringing the way better atmosphere at Air United, and especially Celtic opening up the new stand. This scarf looks good on me. It's quite a small scarf, but. Uh, please Celtic fans, if you know what I mean, what does this mean? Um, but yeah, tonight I think Celtic have already overtook in Ayrshire. We're so many Celtic fans. Less than an hour now before the game kicks off. Um, so we can try and ask a couple fans for interviews. We just did, some, someone said no. But tonight will be a good one. And well, don't really know what I'm expecting. I'm expecting Celtic probably to be the well better side. Um, cause obviously won in the Scottish Cup last season in the league so I think they have a well better chance and they're in a well better place now with Brendan Rodgers obviously Andrew's really good but I think Brendan Rodgers is still as good as well We have arrived to Somerset Park and there's the new stand over there the North Stand So I'm here with Iona and Campbell what do you think it's going to be today? Two three. Two, three. Two, three. Two, three. And how do you think Celtic will get on next season? Good. Good. Obviously winning the league last year. Do you have belief that Celtic can beat Air United today? Scott Brown's side, as you know, a Celtic legend. Aye, Celtic will win today, I think. Aye, alright, thanks guys. Right, so I'm here with Aaron and Air United fan. How do you, what do you think the score will be today? <laughs> one one, and how do you think Air United will get on next season? You don't know. Do All right. Th Aye, Celtic legend. Are you going to get up? Are you going to get promoted? Are you okay? Uh, I'll see you in this Premier shit then. So I'm here with Riley, a uh, Celtic fan, is it? Aye. How do you think they'll do today against Air United? Uh -huh. Really got a keeper. Not Gucky, yeah. The keeper will vote, he's still going to do those. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. And what do you think the score will be today? Mm -hmm. And uh, last question, how do you think? So see today, obviously, manager for United is Scott Brown. Do you th how will it feel to play him again? It's been against him this time. <laughs> be a bit weird. Aye, okay. Thank you, Riley. Aye. Right, so you heard from, from some fans there. I think everyone's so confident for Celtic to win today. I think even the Air United fans were even telling me that they think Celtic's going to win. Which is probably the right case. But we're going to go in now, not over there. And yes, this is going to be a good one. Hope you enjoy. <laughs> We have made it to our seat. We're standing, but 
split just there i've been talking about how mad i was and i just wanted to explain everything that happened and how i'm not happy and i think we are going to email aid about this i just went to go get a drink because it was a it was actually quite hot it was um boiling so we went to go get or just by my, i just went by myself because i had money with me um but i ended up getting squished into a point where i couldn't even breathe um like a parent had luckily pulled me out of where i was in the situation because it was just too big i i think air united overselled listen air united i don't want any bad blood between us but i just wanted to say i think you overselled your tickets too much tonight and led to the point where I'm, 
and and it was too much we couldn't even see the game where i was sitting if you saw like before the second half we went to go to the toilet and then it got stuck in so me and my dad just went you know what what's the point we just had to leave sorry for not um filming the rest luckily there was no more goals uh, so i couldn't film so i didn't really miss anything apparently there was not really much chances in the second half so happy I didn't really miss anything, but not as a great successful match day vlog today. I chose the Celtic again today because I heard it was going to be a sellout. And when I mean sellout, I don't mean like packed like that. It didn't seem as packed, but trust me guys, um, it, it was massive. So I just thought to myself, you know what, this could be a sellout. I'm going to go to the game and we went to the Celtic end because that's where a lot of the atmosphere was. And there was even a pyro, but I missed it because I was at the toilet. But I just saw like the green pyro going up in the air. It was actually a pretty good game besides the fact where uh, I couldn't breathe, uh, getting squished in line um, and overselling the tickets. Even the security guards told us just to email air about it how badly it was and a lot of fans Celtic fans and I think even some air fans are gonna email Air United about how bad this was and trust me if you were went to this game pretty sure you know how bad it was. But anyways guys thank you for watching Air United like I said don't want any bad blood between us I'm just saying you oversell your tickets a wee bit um but hope I, I like Somerset Park a good wee old ground um, but couldn't see much of it because it was just packed but I quite enjoyed it it wasn't the worst but I know what happened so apologies for not filming the rest of the game but that's what happened so I'll see you tomorrow for the next match day vlog stay tuned for it it's gonna be a big one